Hi guys and welcome to this week's video tutorial. This will be another example of a basic kill with the central cannon controlling the central file. So before we continue, a quick analysis of the bot uh, would show that red would have two chariots, one cannon, black would have one, two cannons, one horse, one chariot. Material wise, they would be the same. Both would have one pawn and a full guard. It will be black's turn to move for this bot, so let it switch it. Let us switch to black at the bottom. So uh, red is now controlling the central file. There's always a potential of a checkmate with the chariot. So the red chariot cannot leave the bottom rank, as similar to the previous example. The horse is also ready to go. So the first move would be for black to play h7 plus 8 to go for the elbow horse checkmate. Now, it follows that red would have four ways to counter. Let us see variation one. Black would try, black would try to protect his red file. Red would deliver a check. And black would block the horse. But in doing so, the chariot cannot move anymore and the king would only have this intersection to move to. So black would play r7 equals to 8. r7 equals 9 would also be okay. And black can be, will be forced to capture the horse because it cannot move. And this will be a check. This will win. Of course, of course black can retreat, but uh, it, it will still be a checkmate. Again, this is a very powerful checkmate because the cannon has control of the central file. The advisor cannot move. The elephant cannot capture. Otherwise, the cannon will be delivering a check. So this would be variation A. In variation B, let's say uh, red tries to retreat the cannon to prevent to capture the horse should it go for the elbow horse. So what can black do? He can sacrifice his chariot, delivering a check, forcing the red chariot to capture it. But because the horse is because the black chariot had advanced, the horse is now free to go for the pale corner horse check. Again, the again the <clears throat> the uh, advisor cannot capture the horse or this would be a check by the black cannon so the red king would have to move out and it will be an immediate checkmate so uh, c9 equals to 6 is also viable so this would be the second variation whereby red uh, tries to protect by retreating his cannon in variation c let's say Red tried to move his king to safety at this point. So there are two ways that black can continue his attack. The first would be r7 equals to 6, delivering a check. Let's say black um, moves an advisor because this advisor is protected by the cannon. But uh, red, black would have other ideas, in the, other ideas and he would simply sacrifice the chariot, delivering a check. Now the king cannot move back or the cannon will be delivering a check. So uh, red, red will be forced to capture the chariot. Now at this point in time, red will use the other cannon to deliver a check. Now no, let's say no matter where the where the cannon will move, again red, black will go for the, uh, uh, horse, the horse cannon checkmate. So another way would be to play, um, another, uh, what about playing uh, c5 equals to 6, red would protect in this manner, uh, and black would deliver a check forcing uh, the king up. Now if, if, the, if red captured the chariot, again this would be an immediate checkmate. So the king will be moved up. Red, um, black, uh, the black chariot would then deliver another check. The king cannot move here as it is covered by the uh, horse, so it can really retreat. And again, this would be a checkmate. This would be another way of winning for black. So now to the last variation, R1 equals to 2. Now R1 equals to 2 uh, would be an attempt to try to block, but again, black would have be able to win. So the rear check. Show plus four check. And at this point in time, Black would gladly sacrifice his chariot again. 
Now this is the most compact or tightly knit move in this situation. Black will be forced to capture, otherwise the king cannot move back. And now the double cannons would do work their magic and this will be a checkmate, the elbow horse checkmate. So no matter what, uh, there are still some other variations, uh, other possibilities, but uh, no matter what red would do, uh, he cannot salvage the situation and although complicated, it shows the many possibilities of attacking when a central cannon is uh, in line. So I hope you've enjoyed this short video. If you like the work that I've been doing, please do subscribe to my channel and give me a thumbs up. Thank you.